good morning. How are you? You know what feels really weird? It feels very strange saying to you that 2018 is the year that you get unstuck. It seems like just yesterday that was my mantra. That's what I kept saying to everybody. It was 2017 is the year that you get unstuck. And here we are approaching September 1st. The year is more than half over with. Well more than half over with. The weather is changing. In a little bit, I'll go outside and do my reading and writing and so forth and my goal planning, checking things off. And I've achieved everything that I've wanted to. Last year, I achieved everything fairly early. This year, I achieved everything super early because I'm getting much more streamlined and efficient in what I do. And I can tell you that the unstuck lifestyle is, there's nothing like it. And I'm not ragging on anyone. I guess I'm just saying that. My biggest regrets are that I didn't do it earlier in life. I've had a lot of success, but I wasn't as efficient as I am now. And like the comedian Dave Attell says, if you're ever lost, look for the man with one leg because he knows the shortcuts. He doesn't want to have to walk any farther than he has to. And I guess I can say the same thing about life in general. If you want directions, some of the best places to find those directions are people with gray hair because, number one, they've been around. Some, some of the people with gray hair, I should say. Not everyone who has gray hair is wise. They might have been through a lot, but you can be through a lot and not learn anything. There's knowledge, and then there's wisdom. Wisdom is the application of knowledge. I heard someone say once, you can have 10 years of experience or one year of experience 10 times and I choose to layer one year on top of another and get better and better as the years go on. That's why a person who is a 25 year old ass if you add 40 years to that person and they've never changed, they've never been challenged, they've never sought to transform, that they can become a 65-year-old ass. I've seen that many times. Age doesn't necessarily bring wisdom. Decisiveness brings wisdom. The desire to learn and transform, that's important. Now, I got up even a half hour early, earlier than I usually do. I actually woke up at 4 o'clock feeling fantastic. Got to bed early. Great night's sleep, dreams. Felt good. Literally woke up at 4 a.m. Came downstairs. Plugged in the coffee made my bulletproof, drinking in my unstuck mug. And what was on my mind today was now that 2017 is on its way out, and I am even talking about that prematurely, the reality is very soon I'm going to be saying 2018 is the year that you get unstuck. 
I'll be there for you when you want to get unstuck. I'll be around. No sense in being a voyeur and watching from the outside. It's time to get unstuck. The weather is changing. I find myself going outside now, outside with a uh, hooded sweatshirt on. In the mornings, it is a little bit chilly. And at night when I'm outside, it's a little chillier already. I can't believe this, the end of August. The, the weather has already changed noticeably for me. And if it wasn't for the change of seasons, those change of seasons prepare me for new moves. They spark me. They, they do something to me. When I walk out and it feels cooler, when I walk out and it feels hotter, when I walk out and I smell spring in the air, when I walk out and I'm smelling a crisp, cold, snowy day, whatever the season, it makes me very conscious of time passing by. Other than just looking in the mirror, which also does that, which also shows you that time has gone by. Where do you want to be this time next year? Last year I was saying this to you. Are you further along now, right now, than you were last year at this time? Are you bogged down with some of the same things that you were last year? It's time to get unstuck. It's a great lifestyle. <clears throat> I'll talk to you soon.